Hey everybody, what's up? Giggs here, some Awakened Chaos Era on the Free to Be Elite account. Uh, I thought we were getting a new content drop today, but it's not here. I guess maybe time zones are different, maybe the update's coming later today. Uh, I swear I've seen pictures of this lit up though. I've tried to update my game, I don't seem to have an update available. So I guess if you guys have been able to update, let me know and I'll figure out what's going on. But um, perhaps it's just coming later today. But I'm excited. I'm excited for the new content to come. Um, it's going to be fun to get into. So if it does come out later today, I'll do my best to get a video up and, and do it like a first impressions thing. I kind of I kind of would like to check it out together rather than uh, on my own and then do a video later. I, I'd kind of like to jump into it for the first time with you guys. So if, if, it, if it does come out today, we'll... Uh, We'll just do another video, you know. Um, but I am very interested in it. Apparently, we've got some new champs and stuff coming too. Maybe, maybe they're going to start picking up the pace a little bit and rolling, rolling out new champs a little bit faster. Again, I don't want them to, to match raids pace, but I do feel like we could use some more champs uh, right now, especially elites. I'm definitely all about the elites right now. All right, let's do our free summon real quick, and then we'll we'll talk about what we've been doing. Oh no. Oh no. I can live with that. I can live with Borden. Uh, all right. We have done a ton of glyph farming still. We've just continued to do a ton of glyph farming. We used our gems to buy another XP boost. I'm pretty much just keeping a 24-hour XP boost in stock. And then when it runs out, we just get another one. I feel like that's a pretty good use of our gems, honestly. We are piling up on XP jelly. We Let's find someone I can... Oh, you. Yeah, we're 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 stacking it up, man. We're gonna be in good shape for this promotion event. I actually forgot that it was coming, and and five start a couple of foodies, but I've got a couple more ready to go. So as soon as the promo event starts, we're gonna pop off. Um, I don't think we're gonna have any trouble at all completing it. I'm gonna I'm gonna try to get several six stars made during that event. As far as our glyph situation go, Zachary's at five, Charles is at five, Rog's at five, uh, Baluka's on his way to five. I'm working on him now. Radir's at five. Elson's at five. Uh, we have we have just relentlessly grinded glyphs in the campaign uh, to partially to get that done, but also partially to prepare for the hero promotion event. So we're sitting on four million XP jelly right now. I think we're in pretty good shape. So I'm ready for that to start, which is soon. It's like what next couple of days, maybe tomorrow even. Yeah, so basically tomorrow. Okay, perfect. Let's get rid of all these notifications first of all. Fill in the quest, that's what I'm talking about. Um, all right, what are we gonna do today? We are gonna hit clan boss again. Guild boss, rather. I am hoping that the, actually what we'll do is I'm going to go in and, and level up a little bit more gear on the champs I'm using because I was surprised yesterday that we hit a, what, a 17? We hit a level 17 and their gear is not really that leveled up. I have to, I have to wait on that. I have a couple people waiting, so we'll, we'll check that out uh, after the video. Like, Zachary's gear is decent enough, I guess, and it's all at 12. And then we took in... Who did we take in? We took in... So we took in this squad. Zachary, Rog, Elson, and Connor. So since then, I've gotten Connor and Elson's glyphs to five. Connor may have already been there, but am I right about that? Yeah. And then Elson we got to five. So they've already got boost from their glyphs, but Zachary's gear is at 12. Rog is... Let's get the... I wonder if there's any improvements we can make. We have, like, we've got this now. We could, we could upgrade his boots. Why don't we do that? Why don't we make some upgrades and then we'll jump in and do another clan boss, guild boss run. <laughs> I should have a ton of gear to level up gear with, so I should be able to save my charms. 
I really miss, so there used to be a thing before this last update where you could just hold here and it would select all of that star and quality. It was a great quality of life thing and the update broke it. I thought the update broke it, but I don't know. Now the way they're talking, I'm wondering if it's just been removed. That would be a real bummer because it was a great feature. So we gotta use a couple charms to get these to 12. Got a resistance roll too, not bad. All right, so we'll put these on him. That'll bump his HP up a little bit. And then what else, what else can we do here? What's he wearing? So one health sub, two resistance subs, not bad. Can we, can we do better than that? Focus precision, crit stats, crit rate and resistance. There's a health sub there. That could be kind of nice, actually. Do I want to lose resistance? I won't bother with that right now. I want him to have a little bit of that. What's he wearing here? So nothing good in the subs there. This should be easy to upgrade. HP percentage, that'd be great. Here, let's see. We'll check the jewelry and see if there's any upgrades we can make there. And then we'll go take a look at Elson and Connor and see what we can do. I really wish they'd add that that feature back where you could hold and select all. It was a really, really nice feature. I'm gonna do so much flip farming. have these points to be honest with you. I'm worried about that. And a defense roll. Okay. I'd rather have the HP, but I'll take defense. Alright, let's check actually what we got on this weapon here. Not much at all that's interesting. Looks like this is gonna be a bit of a re a redeering episode. What do we got here? Is that Percentage would be great. Focus and health. I'd like him to have some focus too. Let's let's actually probably go this one. Let's go with this one here. I was actually getting re getting ready to, to do another um, like tips you may not know video, and one of the tips was going to be that you could hold and select gear like I was talking about, and the update dropped and broke it, and I was like, well. Shit. Maybe I'll wait on him to fix it. So hurry up and fix it, you know? We 
should soon start outgrowing. Come on, man. Give me some stacks on some HP. You know what I mean? Help your boy out. Okay, and then... So those changes we want to make. And then now I'm looking for ring. Good, good, good. Please let me have an HP percentage ring. Yes, dude. Oh yeah, we're up a few thousand HP after these changes. Perfect. And then what? What are we, what's he wearing here? We have a better one. It, I don't care about those subs. Let's take this up to twelve as well. Yeah, he was at like fifteen and some change, I think, before these changes. So this is quite a good set of upgrades for him. That's a good, um, you gotta resist the full month. Yeah, that's, that's quite the upgrade for Rog. That's nice. All right, let's take a look at Elson. Yeah, see, Elson sitting at nine with, with some pretty mediocre gear, too. Like, we could get this to 12. This stuff, I don't know if it would be worth... I think I'll just get the main gear up to 12, perhaps, you know? Another crit rate, nice. tired of using gear pieces. I feel like it's taking way too long, so we're just going to use some charms. Not a big deal. We'll get more. Even though they are pretty rare. Don't follow my example here. <laughs> Another focus roll. We're getting some nice rolls. And then... And I think these are all ones I was going to keep. So a little bit of improvement there. Not a ton, but we'll take what we can get. And then Connor. Old Connor. Feel like, yeah, perhaps there are some improvements to make here. Can you not have attack as a main stat on a ring? You can. I don't, I don't own one, really? Interesting to see how much of an impact what we just did had. Like it'll, be, it'll be interesting to, to kind of be able to measure that. Because I'm thinking, hitting it at level 17, while we're still, still very far away from 20, did give me some optimism. Did make me think perhaps this won't be as impossible as I, as I initially thought it was going to be. So...
if I'm not mistaken, after Zachary's turn last time, we, we were only at nine. So, already noticing an improvement here. Taking good damage from hitting Rog, too. That's nice. I think maybe soon we might be able to make some improvements on Charles as well. Just get him up to some... I can't remember. I feel like he's wearing all four-star gear right now. We might be able to get him up to five-star gear. Maybe. He's so strong even on four-star gear. It's crazy. Things are looking good here. We're looking pretty good at the moment. Attack buff here. Yeah, go after him all day, dude. That's that's the one. That's the one we want you to go after. should have us here. We should have a heal or shield. Heal. Perfect. And then he should single target Rog, and then hopefully we get attack buff and shield next turn. sense because he's because he counterattacks. All right, so we are we are we are flirting with 18, but again, I I would be interested to know the math on like how far 18 to 20 is compared to like 18 backwards, you know what I mean? I I feel like it's got to be like 9 or 10 if if not more. That's not a bad run, all things considered. We, we, we are we are creeping up on, on 18 there. Again, still a long way to go. It seems like we're a lot closer than we are, but I think it's doable. I think it's certainly doable. My, none of my gear is really that optimized. Um, it's not leveled up high. I still think that this mission is out of place. I stand by that. I think that this mission, I think that it should be like 17 or 18. And then maybe if you wanted to have one later for tier 20, because I mean, Aside from the people who are now doing insane numbers because of Urzog, uh, the, the, the strongest players that I knew in my guild, in my main guild, were hitting like, you know, level 23. Um, so I just feel like 20 is out of place there. But we made some improvement. We're, we're, we're flirting with 18. I reckon as we get some improvements made, it, I feel like it's going to be possible. But it's, it's still going to take us a little bit, so... What do we got here? Group strikes, try enhancing any. Oh, nice. Okay. Uh, dude, just in time. I'll take a five star pumpkin. What do we got here? Earn. Complete three eight ten times. Three eight and just that's going to be tough for us to do as well, I think. Although, I'm kind of surprised at what we've been able to accomplish already. So maybe not. 3-8. Let's go take a look at 3-8 real quick. How long is this video? A little bit long. A little bit longer than I wanted. Let, let's go check out 3-8 and then we'll, uh, we'll get out of here. Just to get an idea of what we're looking at here. 3-8. And, I mean, we have to run the, the power. 
power to the power squad here. Perhaps we get Celine. Maybe when Celine gets a little stronger, we get her in instead of Charles. I don't know how much she can contribute at the moment. We'll try it like this, though. is there so that maybe they'll hit him and kill themselves if I don't kill them on the first turn. Okay, so that, there's a one turn clear though, if Zachary's a little bit stronger, or Celine's a little bit stronger even. The boss will be the problem here. And then, in a perfect world, I guess Zach would would be would have his ultimate for this. But again, it's also three water champs, so I'm not sure. Maybe we need some lucky crits from Zach. such a jerk, dude. Just randomly gets to hit everybody for no reason. Yeah. This will take us a while, but I do think this is... I think this will be doable. It's gonna be a while though. It's gonna it, it's gonna be more along the lines of a guild boss level twenty situation. But I reckon that's gonna be doable. We can clear it ten times easy anyway. Do that. And maybe get lucky. Maybe get lucky on one. Alright, but I'm gonna get out of here. Like I said, if the new if the new content drops today, I'll do my best to get a video up on it uh, immediately so that we can check it out together for the first time. Um, if it drops today and I don't play it, then we'll just check it out for the first time tomorrow. But I'm pretty I'm pretty determined that the first time I open that new content will be in a video. So um, either way, if not today, then tomorrow, assuming the game updates and good access. So I'm gonna get out of here. I appreciate you guys watching. Hope you have a good one.